Welcome to Psalm Bites, your daily devotional where we will read and pray through the entire book of Psalms in bite-sized portions. Let's begin with two short prayers inspired by Psalm 119.18 in James 1.22. God, open my eyes that I may see wondrous things from your word, and help me to be not just a hearer of the word, but a doer. Today we will be reading Psalm 65 verses 5 through 7 in the New King James Version. By awesome deeds in righteousness, you will answer us, O God of our salvation. You who are the confidence of all the ends of the earth and of the far-off seas, who establish the mountains by his strength, being clothed with power. You who still the noise of the seas, the noise of their waves, and the tumult of the peoples. I'm going to highlight verse 5. By awesome deeds in righteousness, you will answer us, O God of our salvation, you who are the confidence of all the ends of the earth and of the far-off seas. Let's pray. Jesus, you are the one who established the mountains. As it says in John chapter 1, you were in the beginning, and by you all things were made which have been made. You were the one who stills the noise of the seas, and just as you were unmoved in the boat when the storm came upon you and your disciples, so you remain unshaken by the tumult of the peoples. As it says in Psalm 2, when the nations rage and the peoples plot a vain thing to overthrow your leadership, you sit in heaven and laugh, because your lordship is certain and eternal. We trust that you are still on the throne, that you will answer us by awesome deeds in righteousness. You are King of kings and Lord of lords, the confidence of all the ends of the earth, and the desire of the nations. God, would you show forth your power among the nations this day? Would you answer the tumult of mankind with your merciful intervention, stilling the noise of the peoples, and leading the nations to yourself, the Prince of Peace? May we serve as your hands and feet. Help us to fully say like Isaiah, Here we are, send us, to be vessels of your peace and of your power, where we are and throughout the earth. In Jesus' name, amen.